in my three minute talk. So, since the year 1980, individuals with diabetes have quadrupled. This increase has happened worldwide and is centered among low and middle income countries. This is due to the fact that many individuals are overweight, obese, and lack any type of physical activity. As I mentioned, this is happening in low and middle middle income countries. So let's take a closer look at this small dot. This small dot is what I'd like to call home. It is the friendly island of Donga. And it, in 2016, it was named the most obese nation in the world. And many would blame the, the con consumption of cheap, fatty cut of meat that most rich countries would throw away. Today, I will be talking about type two diabetes and it's science. So type 2 diabetes is a metabolic disorder that causes glucose to accumulate in the bloodstream rather than be, rather than be transformed into nutrient molecules that we would use as fuel. So simultaneously in the pancreas, insulin is being produced and its production is, its production is to, it is to consume the the glucose. So if the insulin is not consuming the glucose, that means there's a large accumulation of glucose within the bloodstream, leading to uh, patients suffering from type 2 diabetes. Now, my research is to focus on my people, the Pacific Island, Islander community suffering from type 2 diabetes. If we can take a look at the genome, genome sequence and see if there's a genetic link between type 2 diabetes and my people, and maybe this can bring um, a greater awareness um, and maybe come to a resolution and change of habits, and um, that is my talk.